Hello again and welcome back to Silent Hill. So we finally made it to the other side of town, into the hospital after meeting up with the gypsy later from the church, as well as the doctor from the hospital. And we're going to continue on searching for our daughter Cheryl. I'm pretty sure that she's not in the hospital, but you can't tell. So with that out of the way, let's just continue on where we last left off. Okay, now that we're back here, let's continue to go to this hallway to the door. Of course it doesn't open because it's jammed. And this is where we met the doctor, killing that bird thing. I've already checked that room over there in the last video. And I'm pretty sure I checked this newspaper article that's been torn open. Let me check my map, just to see where I'm supposed to go. That's closed off, of course. And these are the rooms that we're supposed to go, as well as the elevator. Let's have a check. way. There's one room available. And we have here a map of the basement. Of course I'll take it. And nothing unusual outside. Snowing as always. Which is very odd because I wonder if it's actually summertime. Here's the basement key. We're not going to check the basement just yet. Let's just check all the remaining rooms before we go there. Kitchen. Nothing useful. Except for this plastic bottle, which I will take for some reason. And this. Yeah, sorry for not being energetic. I'm not going to be talking that much as I am right now. I'm just caught off with some stuff. The shells are all messed up. Who would do this? As if I already guessed that we probably... Probably it's the person we just met. Maybe not. Books are scattered around the desk. Nothing else special here. Except for this pile of blood with shattered glasses. A glass vial lies shattered. It's not just broken. It looks smashed on purpose. Alright, so take your empty bottle and use it to get all the liquid in. The remaining liquid is emptied into the bottle. Now what have we here? So basically you're gonna have to use that later because it's important. We'll just keep it with us in the meantime when the time is right. And this is the basement key for this door. The elevator doesn't appear to be working. And so is the vending machine, because I'm kind of hungry. Oh well. Let's go to the basement to turn on the elevator. Hopefully there's something good in store for us down there. Or not. Did 
Just these cockroach. Way too many insect infestation. Let me check my map in the basement. More storeroom, boiler room, and generator room. Nothing. Nope. Only room openings. Door left is this. And this must be the generator. The in-house generator powers elevators, ICUs, and operating room only. Of course, I want to press it. Not the kind of sound I want to hear. I wonder if that's actually the music or the generator itself. Let's go start with the second floor. And looks like this area is off limit. Now the third. Oh great, this one's also not available. Hey, I don't remember seeing the fourth floral here. Might as well check it. Okay, that was the same girl from the school. Oh. And from the looks of this, I'm guessing the... This floor is becoming more contaminated. At least not cleaned well. It's locked. Okay, someone is trying to lock me in. Everything is pitch black now. I don't have the map for this place, of course. All right, now that already locked. Might as well go downstairs. There we go. I guess I'm going to have to check these rooms before moving down to the destination. Excuse me, nurse. Are you... Okay, so basically... She's not normal. So I'm guessing that is the appearance of the iconic nurse from the Silent Hill games. 
the later games at least. But you can tell that they have these giant tumor things on their back. So they're completely different. Almost sliced me. Let's see what's in here. What's this? A seal plate. It's screwed into the wall. So it looks like we're gonna have to find a screwdriver of some sort. safe, no. VCR. It's old but usable. I don't have a tape, so... Ooh. Missed that. Shells. That could be useful. Let's see what's in here first. Doesn't look like any fancy bathroom I ever been seen, or been. Looks more like a isolation room for solitary confinement. But anyway, we found this plate of turtle blue. Yeah, that kind of scared me a little bit. This way. The laundry mo room, excuse me. Let me check my map. Hmm, I haven't been in this room. Looks like a bird, bird cage. It's empty, of course. Let me see what's over here. Nothing. Let's move on. Anything here? Just some... Hold up. Bullets and shells. That's useful. A blood pack. And a first aid kit. Yeah, stupid items. Okay, this is the area that that are left in this floor, at least. You see that thing over there that's on its back? Moving around when you kick it. I'm gonna have to save my ammo and use my pipe for now. Exactly a powerful weapon, but at least it gets the job done. I'll cl 
clear. And we found another plate. Cat. Unlocked. Now, let's go to the next floor. It's locked, unfortunately, so first floor it is. Hopefully we just unlock it from there. Oh great. Some of the machine is contaminated. But the health isn't. That's good. Who's there? Doc? Okay, so there's a doctor version of this. Let me take care of them. Yeah, not exactly those kind of zombie that bites you. Let me get my shotgun just to see how... Ooh, and I gotta take care of this. Uh, shotgun, see how powerful this turns out to be with this against them. Just two shots. I'm not going to go upstairs just yet. Let's check in these two rooms. Nothing there. Just some... scabbed window. Or rusted. Whatever. Okay, seriously, what is up with these noise thumping nows? Sounds. <clears throat> Let's have a little look with the map. Medical room, okay. It's locked, of course. A sound is heard from beyond this door. I don't know what it is, but we're not gonna go in there just yet. Time to move on. <laughs> Sorry, Doc, but I don't have time for this. And we found it. 
All right, that is the third time I heard that thumping noise. Fooled me once. No, scratch that. Scared me once. Shame on me. Scared me twice. Shame on you. Scared me the third time, and I don't know what's going to happen when I lose it. <laughs> Probably nothing. So anyway, we got another plate, which is the queen. So we've... Gonna have to go to the basement now. Oh, it was you then, huh? You were trying to bust into some door. Trying to scare me. Not that good, though. Let me check my shotgun shells. I sell plenty, okay. so tough. Okay, there. This door's open. Get off. She's laid out in the bed. Don't feel like checking this out. Of course I'm not. Because this is a morgue. There's got to be something useful around here. I don't see any, but... Can't tell. Locked. Generator room, of course. The generator's on, so I can't do nothing about it. But what do we have here? It is a hammer, of course. Let me just get rid of that. And exchange it with the emergency hammer, which is much bigger than the pipe. Hopefully it's much stronger as well. I'm gonna have to go to the first floor to the door and stairs. That's right, we can now go upstairs. Let me check my map once more. Alright, this is the spot. Let's see how strong this hammer is. Come on. is strong. Let me check in these doors. Nope. Locked. And what do we got here? The Grim Reaper's List. 35. Lydia Fanding. 60. Trevor F. White, 18, Albert Lords, 45, Roberta T. Morgan, 38, Edward C. Briggs. Some sort of puzzle. I don't know, something. Let me check this door. What 
What do we got here? A lighter. Haven't seen these. Kind of seem familiar. Or something. Just in one hit. What the heck is this? Slight. Nothing more than that. Okay. That's pretty odd. Unless it has something to do with the Grim Reaper's list. What? Giant worms. And from the looks of this, it seems like they're eating blood, drinking blood. Okay, so what you're going to have to do is pick up your blood pack and throw it away into an opposite side so these worms can drink it. Just like that. They'll be busy drinking that while you finally get chance to pick up another plate. The plate of Hatter, or Mad Hatter, from Alice in Wonderland. Now let's check this map again. Nurse Center, okay, so this door is left. What's this? Cloud flowing over the hill. Sky on the sunny day. Tangerine, tangerine that are bitter. Lucky four leaf clover. Violet in the garden. Dandelion along the path. On the vet. I can't read that. Sleeping time. Liquid flowing from a slashing wrist. Wait, what? Slashing wrist? Okay. It's locked. There are four square indication of the door. Okay, so this is the puzzle. One of the puzzle. Not the Grim Reaper puzzle. But, get one of the squares plate. For example, the Red Queen. And place her into the upper left like that get another one the Mad Hatter green and place them in the lower right like that the blue one the upper right and lastly the cat in the lower left. And you solve the puzzle. Let me take care of this. You got a very nasty concussion, nurse. You really need to see a doctor. Speaking of which, another one. Wow, just one hit actually does the job. I kind of like this hammer. Get off. What were you going to do? Oh. 
Yeah, that's what I thought. What is up with these nurses? Of course, no doubt that this is a hospital, so of course they're gonna have a nurse. Basement storage room, so we're gonna have to check the other rooms first before we go back to the basement. here. Alcohol. We needed that. Oh. Oh. Okay, that takes care of her. I don't see anything useful, so let's move on. Now the first aid kit. Now let's go to the basement room now. Hopefully Cheryl's somewhere in... Somewhere here. Mm, shotgun shells. Just what I need. And this... Bookcase. Cabinet. There are skid marks from the cabinet. Looks like it's been moved, so turn around and push it. it. Looks like we found a secret room. And this thing looks like a ha hallway under the ga gates. Can't move it since its vines has grown around it. Luckily, we have two items, the alcohol and the lighter. Let's just pour some of the vines. And let's heat up this. This, I meant. There we go. Looks like we found a secret passage. Let's see. That's a pretty long hallway. More of these guys. Nurse. Come on. Oh, you're already dead. Looks like I don't have the map for this. Alright. Let's try the door next to me. Are you serious? Get off. I'm good for now. 
I'm getting my gun. Because this is ridiculous. Yeah, that's what you get. Let's start at the end of the hallway just to see if we can find something useful. Or make it easier to search for stuff. Nope. What's this? Looks like someone's been here. Alicia. Lisa. Alisa. I keep pronouncing that name wrong. But we found one of the keys. So we can go back upstairs and find... Or go check something. Still, I wonder if we can find the screwdriver to... Unscrew that thing. I already checked there, of course. Jesus Christ. I was gonna lose it, but I'm not going to. Okay, basically this is happening potentially. Let's just keep moving. Oh look, there's the cassette tape for the TV and the VCR, but no sign of the screwdriver. Oh well, let's just move on. Oh, I didn't see that there. It's locked. Yeah, of course. Fortunately, we're not going to go further on this. Let's just head back to the elevator. Yeah, I thought that something was going to happen, or another cutscene. Let me check my map just to be clear on things that I have to go. Let's go to the third floor first to see this video. And of course I'm gonna have to edit some things out. Now that we're back here, let's see the video. I gotta use my health. Let's see what we got here.
It appears there are some footage are scattered up, so we're not going to find out what it means, what's going on. Right, so let's head back downstairs on the first floor to check on that room we're supposed to go. And I'm already stuttering right now. In fact, this is the, when I first played the game, this was the last place I ended because I rented this game first time and I just stopped there where I left off. So just for a side note, it's nothing important though, but just to clarify things. Okay, so let's see what's behind door number one, or not. Hello? Finally, someone else who's okay. Who are you? My name's Lisa Garland. What's yours? Harry Mason. Harry, tell me what's happening here. Where is everybody? I must have gotten knocked out. When I came to, everyone was gone. It's awful. So you don't know anything either. Great. I just don't get it. It's like this is all some kind of bad dream. Yeah, a living nightmare. Let me ask you, have you seen a little girl around here? Short, black hair, seven years old? A seven-year-old girl. What, she's your daughter? Yes. A seven-year-old girl. I can't say that I have. I was unconscious all this time. I'm sorry. <sighs> That's all right. Do you know anything about all that weird stuff in the basement? No. Why? Is there something down there? You don't know? Don't you work here? We're under strict orders never to enter the basement storeroom. So I really don't know. What did you say was down there? Well, it's... <clears throat> Damn! My head! What's wrong? Harry? Harry! Let me help you. Harry? Was I dreaming? You were too late. It's you. Yes, Dahlia Gillespie. Tell me everything you know. What's going on? Darkness. The town is being devoured by darkness. Strength must overcome petty desire, childish sleep talk. I knew this day would come. What are you talking about? I don't understand a word of this. Believe the evidence of your eyes. The other church in this town, that is your destination. This is beyond my abilities. Only you can stop it now. 
Have you not seen the crest marked on the ground all over town? So that's what I saw in the schoolyard. What does it mean? It is the mark of Samael. Don't let it be completed. Hey, wait! So I'm guessing that this Samael symbol is the source of all this nonsense going on in the town. Antique store key. So we're gonna have to find the antique store. But based on how long it took me for get this far, we're gonna have to save for now. We probably might know a lot about this darkness and other world thing in the next video, so I'm gonna have to save this for now. So thank you again for watching this video. If there is anything that you like, be sure to give it a like and subscribe. That'll be helpful. So until then, I will see you again in the next video.